Is that really him? You! <laughs> Wait! Where are you going? Oh, jeez! It's moving again! So are we! I don't think you're gonna make it! That was him! No! Kasuna! Behind you! Weird lights. I wonder if they may be some kind of strange phenomenon predicting future and tragic events. <laughs> really? The last episode? Can I eat now? Kasuna, listen up. Take a look at where you stand in all of this right now. You have to consider your strength versus your opponent's, what you want to do and what you are actually capable of. It's a lot to think about. Don't get too intimidated. Dumb kid, you are not getting away. My strength versus theirs. What am I truly capable of? What's my place in this fight? Should I surrender? Hell no, I own these bitches. What is she doing? She actually did it! <laughs> yeah. oh. That's all I got in me right now, boys. Huh? I'm gonna go find your sister. You stay here and finish what I started. See you in a bit. Did she just give us an order? Yeah, she's Desert Punk's apprentice through and through. And we're still stuck doing the grunt work, which is fine by me. Akio, Haru! Let's show these tank toting tools what the Machine Gun Brothers are packing! Yeah! <laughs> Is that you, Sergeant? Chairman. What's going on in here? You're too late, Natsuko. The whole facility's been destroyed. Everything. Every experiment is wiped out. It's all over. Everything's out of whack. The lab's been destroyed. Only the Dark Ages cannon is still active. What kind of cannon? Particle beam. That crater we are deep inside was cut into the Earth by this beam thousands of years ago. Then that light we saw in the sky was... It's an atmospheric reaction as the device warms up. We have to leave, now. It's too late. You two need to find some optimism. This isn't my only laboratory, but we have to fire the beam to give those trespassers what they deserve. Nobody screws with Kaizuka! You can't fire that weapon, it's suicide! Ah, uh, poppycock! The accelerated neutrons in the beam will reach a velocity great enough to vaporize every living thing in this place! Have you lost <laughs> your mind? How is blowing all of us up not suicide? I have an escape route planned. We'll be long gone before the blast happens. But we can't... didn't ask your opinion. But why, Kaizuka? <laughs> I've poured my soul into this development, and those bottom feeders tried to tear apart everything I've built. They deserve every ounce of pain coming to them. <laughs> that old dude has put on one hell of a show for a long time, and now we all get to see the sticky turd for what he actually is. <sighs> didn't expect to see you here. Well, here I am. Oh, 
Shu, I'm sorry. <sighs> We're pinned down! I don't want to die! I don't like this any more than you, but we gotta play this like the punk would. What? Didn't he come damn close to killing himself? Kasuna, you remind me of a wet rat. Always looking for a quick way out of the sewer. Have the gun! Oh! Oh! You're getting fast! I don't have time to waste messing around with a backstabbing pity hamster like you! Oh, your master vanishes for a bit and you get a nasty little mouth! Huh? They're making this way too easy for me. <laughs> What the? I'm surprised you didn't remember this trick from last time! Your new buddy Desert Punk showed us your one weak spot a long time ago! No! Wolverines! <laughs> I'm disappointed. You've learned nothing. All this time and you're no better now than you were then. I suppose that means... That Kanto Desert's baddest power, babe, isn't actually you. Cause it's us. <laughs> hm. I bet you never thought... ...that your life would end here. <laughs> what the hell? Why are you here? Fulfilling my contract. Rain Spider! You've got razor wire wrapped around your body. Just like a fly, you're trapped in the spider's web. Try to escape and the web will only get stickier. The point is, keep your ass still. Yasuna! Where are you? Are you dead? Those guys are still alive? I guess that means they were actually able to bring down the dragon. What do you think you're doing? I can't go out like this. I said don't move! <gasps> She's got a grenade! Later. Rain Spider, move! I never thought you listened to a thing Desert Punk said. Shut up! I practiced everything he taught me! I was wrong. That was one hell of a shot. Now go find your master. But you need help. Go! Get out of here before you die like me! <laughs> At least you didn't hit me in the assets. I can go out in one piece. That's enough for me. Run, Kasuna. He won't wait around here forever. Go! <laughs> wait! What are you doing? You're not going to finish the job? <laughs> I know tomato juice is expensive, but it did save my life. <sighs> Too bad it couldn't do the same thing for Kasuna. I'm going to miss that scrawny leech. Time for Junko to hit the road, folks. I know those eyes too well. They possess the same look of rage and calmness that mine did so many years ago. Enough of your hoity-toity words, geezer. Get to the point. Exactly what I mean. I'll pop a bullet through your jugular in the middle of one of your speeches if I have to. You can't do that. No kidding. What did I do? You're a liar, Kaizuka. You claim that all of your work is for the people, but the sad truth behind all of this is that you plan to take control of the desert as well as the people you claim to represent. No, you've got it all wrong. The only reason we're here is to ensure a decent future. He's not anything like you, Desert Punk. Ah! Move again and I'll shoot you in the face. Kaizuka's money still isn't enough for him. He can only think of himself, which doesn't leave any room for you guys. What happens after you kill me? Any big plans? How about a vacation? No amount of talking's gonna slow me down. Or maybe you and your little girlfriend can start a family together. 
<laughs> Kanta! Uh -oh. Letting you stay alive was a huge mistake, and I don't plan on making it twice. Wow, you're cool. Kaizuka may be a self-involved egomaniac. Natsuko, what are you saying? I'm saying that at least he's not so heartless that he would betray those closest to him like Kanta would. <laughs> I can't believe you fell for my oldest trick. Even Kasuna sees through that one by now. And if that one got you, I know you won't see this one coming. What? Take her. Human beings should not waste life, for it is precious. How the hell did this thing get He's a hold of me? He's got a cloaking device. So, what do you say we put an end to this right now? You're going to die down here with us, you know. I'm not going to die. Not today. You might not have a choice in it. We'll see. Ugh. Let's go! Here we come! There she is. You made it. Punk is here too? Whatever. Just shoot. Yeah! Oh, don't let him get away. Corey, I need some help over here! Come on! Huh? Our bullets are useless against that wall of a robot. What are we going to use? Are you okay, Natsuko? Yeah, I'm fine. But we have to get out of these ruins before they blow. Ugh. Master, what's going on? enough to get up here. Master? Master! Hey -o. Found him! They're all over the place! <laughs> Why don't these dudes leave us alone? These dudes ain't balloons, if you couldn't tell. Kata, you son of a bitch! <laughs> I suppose we don't have much of a choice. Then let's tear them up! They'll either kill us now or later, and I hate waiting! No, don't! Yeah! 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 Uh, uh, ow, that hurt! What are you doing? <laughs> Ciao, bitches! Oh, that guy sucks. Eh, let him go. He's just a cockroach. Master? We thought you were dead. From the second I saw you again back there, I knew I had to tell you things. Things that I didn't think I'd ever have the chance to say. I don't know what's happened to you, but you need to know this about me. I've always considered you my savior. You see, I made mistakes today the same as when you and I were together, but the difference is that back then all I had to do was follow orders, and now I have to give them, and sometimes I don't trust myself with how I think, and I thought that you said And that's where you're life. wrong. I wasn't interested in saving anything but my own pale ass. I was using all of you. I needed an easy way out of that place and you guys were there. Then I screwed up. I got caught, but I flipped my situation and joined these guys. Huh. You sold out the people you know best to get in bed with the bad guys? Is this a war? You can call it what you want, old man. But you know what it is. There's been pressure on our boundaries. Maybe you're underground mercenaries or the Dragnet elite. I don't care. I'm just here to stop you. So you're just here to cash in my body for another step up the government's military ladder. Anything goes out here. This is a war, right? You 
you're gonna use us to take over the Oasis. That's your plan. Yep. Where are you, Kasuna? I'm sorry. I'm sorry I dragged you all into this. No apologizing! Yeah, sis! I'm proud that I got to fight this battle with you! We followed you into hell, we'll follow you out! Thanks, guys. Kasuna! Yeah, what? I want to give you a choice. What you've shown today says that you might have what it takes to do this. You can come over to my side, but you have to tell me now. Huh? Oh, uh... I, uh... Well... I know it might be hard. War can be confusing, but know that inside this confusion, you can finally become Kanto Desert's baddest power, babe. <laughs> Master? Yeah? I have to know something. The fire that burned down Matsu's store. Did money from your pocket pay for that? Oh. Yeah, that. If anyone had known I was still alive, there would have been some big problems. <laughs> After I went back for the winch, I didn't have much of a choice. I thought about feeling bad about it, if that matters. <laughs> what are you doing staring down that little girl? You were supposed to kill Kaizuka! <gasps> yeah, I'm on that. Nats, you stupid! Piece of trash! Show me what you're made of, you pig! Hands up right now! Uh, <laughs> you slime! I'm gonna kill your father! Kasuna? Oh no. Where's your winch? Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Now we have to deal with this kid. Uh, Hulk syndrome. Uh. Now! What did you do? I bet you didn't know that Machu's witches could do this! No! Kasuna, you are in so much trouble, young lady. <laughs> Clever. Anyone want to leave? But where do we go? No clue, but we gotta move fast! <laughs> I am Rain Spider, savior of the sands and all her people. This is it. That truck is our ticket out of this place. Uh, oh. Okay. okay. They actually had a plan B. I never expected it with that group. But they did leave one behind, which means they must not be that organized. Master? I'm not switching sides! From now on, you're my enemy! That's your decision. Can you live with it? <sighs> I just saved your ass, punk. <laughs> I'll follow you wherever you go! You have to do whatever's necessary. <sighs> Idiot, why did you shoot at that thing? I'm sorry! <laughs> no! Please, let's go home! Stop the madness! You know what I really want? A 308 caliber assault rifle! It's so heavy. I'd be useless after an hour. You brat. Uh, thanks! Thanks, Master! 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 Master!
there's that other voice in my head that tells me, you're stupid, that's your master. It'd be so much better over there with him. <sighs> Betraying us the way he did was something very much in character for him. I don't know how good that is. As bad an apprentice as I was to him at times, he said I'd gotten better. But if I went with Master, it'd be another lifetime of being his little sidekick. That would ensure that I'd never become the baddest power babe of the Great Kanto Desert, which I can't let happen. <laughs> Let's get out of here, McCory. Time is up. <laughs> That was the moment it happened. The moment the dead of night gave birth to mid-afternoon in the great Kanto Desert. A place where the brutal and the righteous are brothers. Great Kanto Desert. During the day, the temperature soars above 120 degrees in the shade. At night, it takes a nosedive well below freezing. These are the ruins of a civilization, one that fell under the weight of its own thoughtlessness and greed several hundred years ago. It is now simply a grave reminder of the lost promise of those who destroyed themselves. The Great Kanto Desert. The fiercest and most brutal people in human history live day to day in this scorching hell on Earth. It is a life of loneliness and scavenging. Today, these hardened people of the desert live with bolstered pride, which also seems to be one of the things that brings about hard times for them. It's a vicious cycle, but oh well. That's the way it goes, I guess. And these people sure aren't changing. Dumbasses.